Hey everyone, Steve here with my late 20s Wurlitzer wind-up consulate phonograph. Well, I'm very happy. Uh, over the past weekend, uh, I had some time to finally refinish the cabinet. When I acquired uh, this phonograph last year, uh, it was in it was in pretty bad shape. Uh, the uh, a lot of the wood shading was uh, was light in color, and the doors were uh, were really dark. It just looked off. It didn't match the cabinet. Didn't match at all uh, the different uh, sections. So uh, I was able to do a complete refinishing, and um, and I think it looks great, and I'm very happy. And uh, I just wanted to share with you guys. Give you a short little video here. Doors. Let's uh, let's open her up. I did not finish the interior part of the doors, and if I get a little more time, uh, you know, in the future, maybe I'll do that. But that they don't look they don't look horrible. So there's the uh, grill, and this does have a straight wood horn. It's not a uh, not a divided horn. Oh, there's the lid. Nice and uh, shiny. I just love, love this walnut. The grain is beautiful. It has a beautiful look to it. I did not um, mess with the under part of the lid. Uh, it was already in really nice condition. And I didn't want to mess this logo up here. This Wurlitzer logo. Well, like I said, this uh, phonograph was made in the late 1920s. I'm not 100% sure whether it was actually made by Wurlitzer. Whether another company had had built this phonograph and Wurlitzer just slapped their logo on it. But um, I'll show you. Here is a ad from the late 20s actually promoting this phonograph. And as you can see, it also uh, offers some portable phonographs as well at a low price. And it does have a Toman reproducer. Now this whole um, tone arm and um, reproducer, this was this was missing when I first acquired this phonograph, and uh, it took me a while to to uh, find the right one, so it would uh, it would play right, it would track right. Uh, it had to be the right distance, uh, the right measurement, and I finally was able to get that. I think I went through two or three different ones till I finally got this one, and um, and it sounds really good. Uh, the reproducer so that's on there so look forward to uh to some future videos but i just wanted to share this one uh with you with you guys well thanks for watching and uh we'll see you next time